Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name's Inside A Gamer. Welcome to a new game, Kebab Chef's Restaurant Simulator. Now, I love my cooking sims. I've been really excited for this one. I've had it for a few days, but I haven't actually tried the game yet, so I'm quite excited to give this a go. Currently sitting at very positive reviews on Steam, so it's very promising. Released on the 19th of January uh, by Biotech Gameworks. So Kebab Chef's is a co-op cooking and restaurant management game that can be played up to four players, design your own restaurant, cook delicious foods, fill your menu with recipes, feed customers, and become the biggest kebab restaurant in town. So the multiplayer of this game is what interests me me the most uh, if any of you have this game and want to do a live stream with me next week uh, let me know in discord come join us in discord links in the description down below just uh, ping me a message say yeah, i'll be keen and uh, we'll try and get four of us together and we'll do a live stream but i will do a single player series but i want to do a live stream on the side doing something different trying the multiplayer see if it's fun all that kind of good stuff okay so what we're going to do we're going to start our single player series Okay, so currently there is a sandbox mode, which is provides with limitless gameplay opportunities. Start your adventure by restoring a abandoned shop and small neighborhood. Expand your recipe book. Uh, that's all good kind of stuff. So we're going to put the tutorial on, because I've not played yet. I'm quite excited to see how this all runs. We've only got the one map. Now, this is early access, so lots of things will change, I'm sure, over a period of time on the game. And, uh, yeah, quite excited for it. Okay, so we wake up, we got a phone call here from my father. Hey kid, are you still asleep? I told you to come down here in the morning. Quit being lazy, come meet me in front of my old restaurant. Today is an important day for you. Call ended. Okay, so here we go. We're in, uh, well, this must be our, our house, right? So uh, this is quite nice and cozy. I love the art style. The art style looks great. Uh, how, do, how do I get out of here? Oh, here we go. So we're here uh, onto the streets. And that looks like my grandfather over there with a little exclamation mark on his head. Mm. Okay, it's time for you to stand on your own two feet. I love the I love the uh, the the, the words there. My own two feet. <laughs> uh, I'm in to guide you to your family heritage with this restaurant. Take your first step towards becoming the best chef in the city. Mm. I see you're impatient, and this is a new generation. All right, then take the key and let's get us inside. Okay, we'll take the key off him. Thank you, uh, Granddad. Here we go. This is going to be our beautiful restaurant, apparently. Mm. Okay, turn those lights on, would you? Let's see what it really looks like. Looks like a mess. Mm. Oh my dear, this is a total mess. Looks worse than I remember. Good to be back anyways. We should get cleaning this mess first. I mean, you should. You know, I really like to help, but I'm an old man now. Okay, of course. So we got to pick up stuff. Okay, easy enough. Lots of rubbish. Quite a big space to start with, actually. Okay, clean all the dirt on the floors and walls. Okay. Okay, nice job. It's indeed a good beginning after all. That's always important to keep your workplace clean. Now let's fix those tainted walls and floors. Uh, what was that online store you were mentioning? Okay, open up the tablet, press tab. Open up the warehouse. Okay, navigate ser to services category. Okay, it's flashing for us, which is good. Uh, so, yeah, we don't have any money. Well, I have money, but I think it just wants us to do this for now. Okay, navigate to the floor. And then change the old flooring. Mm. There we go. Nice and smooth, better than ever before. Now let's get rid of the broken furniture. Okay, so edit mode. If you want to edit a furniture station, uh, we can press C. Okay, got to try and remember that. Okay, sell damaged objects. Uh, so F cells. Okay, if it keeps getting better, don't you think? Now we have space, we can fill it with brand new furniture. Open that store thing again, would you? Okay, we're going to the warehouse. Place two tables. Um, all right, well, let's put a big one down. Somewhere like here, right? And uh, we'll put a small one down. 
Something over here. I mean, the restaurant is something we can work on. Okay, we also need a sink and a counter. It's important to have some groundwork. Okay, navigate to counters. Okay, place the countertop. So I think it's any of these, all right? Uh, do we get anything out of having the drawers? I don't know. But it matches what we just took away that was broken. Okay, navigate to the station section. Uh, place a knife rack. Is that what it is? That's a cutting station. Horizontal knife rack. Okay. Okay, alright kid, it's almost done now. Now we need some kitchen tools to get you started. You need to go and pick up the package from the market. The owner of the place prepared it for me. I know him for decades. He'll be visiting his place very often. Okay, so we've got to go to the market. And I'm assuming that means outside somewhere. Oh, okay. We've got some dishes just appeared. We've got a radio. Turn the music off because I don't know if it's copyrighted infringement. We've got salt and pepper. This is obviously the uh, the grill. Okay. Off to market then, I suppose. I'm assuming it's this guy, right? Oh, you must be the new chef of the neighborhood. Your dad was a great cook. I'm really happy that the place is back up. Here is the goods that your father wanted uh, me to prepare. You can always visit my place if you need something. Okay, so mixing bowl, skewers, kindling bag, coal bag. All right, let's just take the whole box for now. We'll go back to the restaurant if I can go through my door. Nice job, now get everything out of the box and let's get cooking. Alright, so let's place the box down. We want to take from the box, right? Alright, let's go around this side. Why can't I place you down there? There we go. Alright, okay, now we have a decent small restaurant to begin with chasing your dreams. Now let's get that delicious part. Remember the recipe Booker gave you? It's great for you to save them digitally. Okay. Uh, restaurant menu. I suppose it's that one, right? Add some recipes to the menu by dragging them over. So at the moment, we're allowed to do grilled beef. Check the recipe details. Okay, pin active order. Mmm. Okay, if we need ingredients to cook, that means it's time for shopping. There are three local shops that you can buy from, grocery, butcher, and the market. I know the owner lads uh, for a long time. They always have the fresh ones. Okay. As every restaurant ingredients necessary for you to cook delicious meals, you run out and use them by visiting the butcher, greengrocer, and market. Okay, so what the hell do I need? I need a ribeye. The butcher's shop. Butcher, butcher. Ah, here he is. Okay, so look, we these are all locked at the moment. Can I not get more than one? I mean, is this a fridge? That looks like a fridge for now. Okay, now we've got to go to the grocery store. Uh, it's this one, right? Add tomatoes to the basket. So, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, we need parsley as well. I don't really think they need to go in the fridge, to be honest with you. They could probably go on that shelf. It's almost time for me to eat. I hope my child can cook me a delicious beef. Okay, is that all I have to do now? 
Take the ribeye chunk from the shopping box. Okay, look. So we could get rid of this box by doing this, maybe. Okay, so it chops it quite nicely and easily. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Take a ribeye slice. Add black pepper to the ribeye slice. Well, why am I putting it down? Here? Okay, so three pepper and three salt. Take the coal package, pour some coal onto the grill. Take the kindling package, add some kindling, okay. Wait for the bottom side of the ribeye slice to cook. So are we putting you on here? How do I know when the bottom side is cooked? Whoa! Okay, now we're going to flip it. Take a plate from the cabinet. Uh, doesn't matter what kind of plate we take. Okay, slice the uh, side ingredients. All right, well, let's take the steak back in the fridge, right? And then parsley as well. What the hell happened there? Surely that parsley needs to be cut right. I didn't grill any tomato though. This thing must, um, must cut, right? Ah, I can just take a piece. Okay, service counter. Serving the counters is where you finalize your food presentation before placing a dish on the serving counter. Make sure it is on your menu. Okay. Do I have a serving counter? It's over there, right? Okay, bacon, ingredients, heat. Yeah, it could be better. Mm. Okay, well, we're open. Of course, after every South Side customer, there will be a dish to clean. You have to clean the plates before using them again. We want customers to get their food and dirty plates, right? Okay. So that's what we've got to use the sink for. I'm going to take his money. Got my 10 quid. Is that it? Mm. Right. I'm confused. Because I put the dish there, they're just going to take what they want. And how many are here? 
As you may realize, there are many variables that define how good you run a restaurant. You might be good at cooking, but also have to be fast and always must be hygienic. Right. Okay. Mm. I think you pretty much got the basics. You can make it the beginning from here to go to bigger as you move forward. Now, flip that sign and let people know you're ready to serve. Mm. Well, we've already done that, so... Mm. So, I'm a bit confused. When I make one dish, is that all I need to make for the whole day? Or does it run out? I don't know. Does, when does this run out? I don't know. Lots of things I don't know about right now. Okay, so I have to interact with them to get the bill. I see, I get it now. Alright, that's fine. I've put the plate somewhere else. Ah, so now I've run out. Oh, oh, oh okay. Oh, now I get it. Okay, so we need one, two, two, three, one, two, three. Oh, yeah, that. Okay, I've got the plate there. Let me go to chop this tomato up. Oh, you're not going to wait much longer, I know. I'm coming, I'm coming. Alright, the one thing I don't know is, can I keep... Okay, so, why was this not as good? It was overcooked. Mm. Jesus Christ, I'm running around like a madman already. So I wonder, can I just keep cooking and filling that service thing up? I, I wonder how this all works, to be honest with you. Okay, I need to put plates back in here. Oh, holy cow. Okay, take money before plates. I hope you enjoyed. So if we had a few of us, like, you could be all in different sections and, you know, we could make it quite funny, I think. Definitely this needs to be a stream, I think. Mm. Oh, no, I've run out again. Huh. Well, I'm going to make these two my last uh, people for the day. So that's all cleaned up. I can't put any of that out. Um, not much I can really do, is there? Clean this so-called of a mess of my restaurant. All right, I think we're good. Let's let's go home then. That's what it wants us to do for the day. I didn't rank up, which is a bit of a shame. Oh no, we did. So we made 800. I spent a lot. <laughs> God. Hey, not a bad day. All right, let's try and get another day done. Who's this fella? Mm. 
Mm. Hey, master. Oh, look what I have here. An apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Mm. I've seen this place rise and fall before. You must be this kid. Let's hope you're not another disappointment. Mm. I hope you understand the delicate nature of the industry, kid. This is a culinary jungle. Only the strongest mm. survive. Let's see if your little venture can withstand the heat. Mm. Get to the gourmet authorities' approval first, and then maybe huh. I'll be willing to confront you if I'm in a good mood. Mm. Good luck, newbie, if that is possible. Okay, gourmets. What's this? Gourmets are food judges that have to overcome before facing the master. Okay. Well, you need three dishes, so yeah, can't be doing any of that right now. Alright, let's get in. Let's uh, cut our beef. Uh, uh, okay. Alright, that's now hot enough. Oh no, the veg is rotten! ideal ah uh, that's far in the bin Alright, we have to go get some fresh veggies. Okay, maybe all vegetables need to go in the fridge too then. Create a menu, open the restaurant. Well, I've only got grilled beef, so... But we can unlock this one now. Which we we're going to do. Let's get the restaurant open first. Running around like a madman. Okay, so menu. We can unlock you now. Chicken breast. But I can't put it on the menu yet. I'll have to wait a day. Oh, he paid me a bit more. Okay, so what we'll do, we'll cook another steak. Okay, restaurant has leveled up. I'm going to grill a tomato and put it on there, see what happens.
Uh, it's missing great. Okay. Can't do it like that. That doesn't work. Mm. Now, saying that, is this like a storage room? Is it a cold room? I don't know if that's what that is, to be honest with you. Is it a bathroom? We're going to have to cut another chunk of steak here anyway, so let's get it cut. I feel like it needs a source, to be honest with you. But yeah, how do we get to night time already? Day is over. Oh, okay. What? That day seemed to go really, really fast. Oh, I'm gutted. Basically, to serve more, I need to put in another table or two in here, don't I? Alright, we'll do one more day with the new recipe. Okay, so they're all in the fridge, so I'm going to hope that they survive this time. Everything else is kind of clean. Fortunately, I've got uh, food that's not going to survive a day, most probably. Woo! Right, we've got some new recipes. So the first thing we need to do then, if we go to the menu, we're going to put the grilled beef, of course. Uh, chicken legs or tomato soup. We'll do tomato soup. Let's put these two on first. Um, tomato slice, milk, butter, boil. How do, hang on, how am I going to boil them? Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What else do I need? Milk and butter. We're not going to get that in here, are we? And pasta. Okay, yeah, so the fridge seems to work. Right now I need milk and butter, which I'm assuming we're going to get from in here. Not cheap. How do I how do I get a cook pot? I mean, this is all furniture stuff. And I'm okay with actually buying another table. 
people keep, seem to come in singly, not as in a group at the moment, so that's fine. Um, no, that's the gourmets. Don't want to do that. Cook pot. Okay, so there must be somewhere here I get the cook pot from. Uh, actually, I just realised as well, I probably need a bag of them. I'm going to need that cook pot. Okay, so the day doesn't start, so you can do your prep first. So that's okay. That's lit. Okay, yeah, cook pot can go in there. Okay, so add to cook pot water. One point two. I have no idea how much water's in this now. Yeah, a little bit over. Eight tomato slices. Right, I just need to know, does that count as one? No, that's four. Okay, so two of them. Milk, 0 I don't know how much milk is in a friggin' tub. 0 0.2. Okay, so it's a whole milk tub. 200 grams of butter. Okay, one is 200 grams. Okay, that's fine. So that can go in there. I want to get some of my ingredients set up nicely. enough tomatoes for a few days anyways okay this needs to boil surprise there's no uh, salt or anything all right I'm gonna bring a steak ready as well Parsley that. Do need another tomato. Okay, well that just came too fast, so that is too much in here. Right, 
Cooking the steak will take me two seconds, so... Must be a way for me to put that back in there, right? Can I only serve one dish at a time? Oh, do I need another serving booth? Is that how this thing works? I get it. She paid for a steak. Might move these serving stations somewhere else. All right, try and get them in and out as quick as we can. I can do the mixture. All right, we've run out of soup. Mm. And I've done it again. I've over poured. That'd be okay. Cold. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Oh, okay. I would say this day has gone very well. I wonder could I have just put that suit back on the heat? I wonder will that stay there for tomorrow? I've got a fair table, but we don't seem to serve more than two customers. I don't know, is that just the way it is or what? That'd be my last custom, anyways.
I don't really know what to do with this plate. Okay, throw it back in, apparently. All good. Uh, able plate, we'll throw you back in for now. Mm. There's a plate over there that I can't do nothing about. Remove. Okay, guys, so look, I'm going to leave it there. Is this a bathroom? This must be a bathroom, right? Maybe we should get something sorted out. I'm going to leave it there for today. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Is this something you want to see some more of? Um, I love this kind of stuff, so I'm very happy to keep going. Uh, but let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that like bell. And uh, other than that, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.